just became passionate about Finnegan's Wake. Not the whole book per se, but the, the, form, the form he plays with within the language and the, and the incredible uh, intersection of different ideas that are contained all the time in the, in the mixing of the language. But if you let it go um, and go with the flow of it, it is, as Joyce described it, a sound dance. Now lay by the macro bar, anemone activescent, the temperature is returning to normal. I was on tour with Marco Rose Terminus in Sydney, Australia in 2011. And uh, we were asked to do a reading for Bloomsday, the three of us in the cast. And I said, uh, yeah, I know, happily I'll do a reading from Ulysses if you let me do something from Finnegan's Wake. And they said, well, that's a great idea. So I read the last page of Finnegan's Wake where the river disappears into the ocean. And then when I read it publicly, uh, that, that final section, something happened in the room. I really felt that uh, there was some, some shift in the in perception, atmosphere, collective space and uh, by the time I'd finished reading it in that public space I had decided that's my next project the voice of the river